Okay, welcome back to MKXL, everyone. I am currently checking out the four new characters released with Combat Pack 2. We looked at Boraichu first. We looked at Leatherface. Now it's time for Triborg. Triborg. Looks pretty fucking cool. First character with four variations. So you know what? Let's start with him. Cyber Sub-Zero. And you know what? Let's fight against regular Sub-Zero. Because why not? Four variation character looks very complicated because basically all of these characters are a separate character. Just like a completely uh, different one. I know that he has some similar strings and kind of moves that have the similar kind of idea. They each have a projectile, um, like a special move. What is it? Like a slide, like a mobility tool and everything. Whoa, that's really fast. It's as quick as Sub-Zero, right? Wait, let's have a look. Yeah, it's the same. Actually, Sub-Zero's might be quick. Quicker, I mean. Alright, whatever. I just wanted to check that out. Combos, 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 combos. Like I said, with Bo Raicho and Leatherface, you want to look for... Whoa, that's plus. Okay, we're looking at these two first. Just like high mid mid, normal. Not that useful, I think. But what is this? Hmm. Looks like it has a gap. If you want to see if a string has gaps, uh, put block mode into always and reversal mode on and like do the icy slide. Oops. See? Yeah, it has a gap. What about... Yeah, gap as well. But that actually... Huh. That's kind of weird. You can, like, avoid the slide. Alright. Yeah, I just had a feeling that had a gap. Okay. Maybe these aren't that good then. We'll come back to them. I'll keep this one up. Dry ice. And you can enhance. Oh, whoa, that's really good. And it's an overhead too. You can go overhead into ice. And then maybe you can go into like slide. Let's see. Just like a very basic combo. I mean, this is one meter. Yeah, that's not worth it. 17%. But this is a cool move. Oh yeah, and the drone. We'll get into the drone later because I know that's kind of sub... Uh, um, cyber subs specialty ice strike hmm that looks very cool can you like drone enhance it too yes you can looks cool seek and destroy okay that's his low so we can go did that combo I don't know I think it did wait come on What's this projectile? I'm doing the right thing, right? Huh, weird. Hmm, why can't I... See, you can cancel into that. Kind of looks like so far that he suffers from the same thing as Sub-Zero in that he... The ice removes a lot of the scaling. That's a good move, by the way. System lock, okay. Nice. All of the robots have this string. I do know that. And they all have like special properties. Like Sector uses the flamethrower. Cyrex uses the bomb. But it's all the same. Okay, let's see. What is this? Nice. It's a knockdown. Actually, not the best. Yeah, this is not the best. It's safe though. Okay. Some weird strings here. It doesn't have a lot, actually. Let's check this out. Looks cool. Plus two on block. That might actually be pretty good. That might actually be better than this. And then he also has this. Whoa. Not safe though. And doesn't look like you can combo outside of the first move. So maybe you can go like... This guy has some weird timing on his strings though. Alright, let's have a look at this. 
Are you kidding me? Low overhead? Nice. Not safe, I'm guessing. Yep, not safe. But this is safe. Yeah, because it you can't probably combo off of this. Yeah, that definitely not. But it's nice. This is nice. You can like... Yeah. That's not that good either. So you can like hit the opponent with a low. And if you're in the corner, you can like basically switch sides with him. That's really awesome. I'm guessing all of these... Yeah, all of the cyborgs have this because this is a universal strength. Alright. Those are his strings I like. Special moves. He has the ice ball. We looked at that. Ice beam, the slide. This dive kick is fucking cool. And you know why it's cool? First of all, he has two distances he can go. And I saw this. This was leaked. That he has a brutality. Look at how cool the special moves. Is. This has to be one of the coolest special moves in the game. That is fucking badass. Oh, by the way. I didn't mention this, but I'm playing Cyber Sub first because I really like this character in MK9. Even though I never played MK9 on online or anything, I did play with my friends and things like that. And Cyber Sub was always my favorite. He has the bomb as well. Is he close? Does he have a far one? Yes, he has. So he has this. It's a low, which is kind of dirty when you think about it. Doesn't stun for long. Yeah, that doesn't stun for as long as the ice ball does. And the far one, of course. Can you like... Wait, wait a second. And if we do... Pretty much low overhead at the same time. Wait, he also has like something I saw. I don't know if this was a leak. Yeah, he has this move. Look at this shit. It's like fucking Dragon Nagina Tatanya. That's ridiculous, that move. That alone makes him insane. Like, look at the range on that. You just like throw that out. And this is the thing. The drones. So. We go like this. Hold the drone down. See he uses the drone to buff his moves. Which is really awesome. You can only put three out I guess. So we can go like this. Use up a drone. Wow that's really cool. And he can like buff everything, like he can do his... I don't think he can do his slide, maybe. Uh, he can do this string. You basically have to hold... Okay, yeah, you have to hold down the button. And Ice Blast, let's try this. Oops, did I reset? Yes, I did. I thought I would freeze him, but I guess not. So what happens if you... Oh, did you see that? takes the opponent's life off and then you probably have incentive to wait as long as possible so if you have the drone out and you use the buff to fireball you want probably want to wait before going in this is his best string so far from what I've seen can he combo this kind of a weird input maybe he can combo No, I don't think he can. He can do the low though, can't he? Again, this character doesn't look so ridiculous. So far, the most ridiculous character I've seen here in Combat Pack 2 is Bo Raicho. Like Bartitsu variation. These guys all look pretty fair. Um, just like the dive kicks. He can drone buff that. Oh wait, no, I did the wrong thing. Maybe just like does more damage. A really cool idea for a variation, by the way. This guy. Oh, he can drone buff the thing. What does it do? Does it? Oh, it's, it's, it just takes the life away. It's actually not a bad mechanic. Hmm, this character looks pretty complicated. I'm liking him. I'm probably gonna be covering these uh, characters the least. Um, by that I mean Triborg and Alien because. Um, I'm really not, not that interested in them. I know a lot of people love these characters, and I can see why, because these guys are really cool. But I'm definitely not going to spend as much time with them as I did with Bo Raicho. And then, in the end, even... Oh, wait a second, what was that? Oh yeah, that was just the enhance. And then you can get three drones if you EX. This character, again, looks pretty advanced. 
and then uh, I don't know like shit maybe you can like dive kick I don't think you can combo off the dive kick it's just like and then maybe you can go into it's not that's not a launcher that way though I don't know kind of have no idea how to combo with this guy so far because none of his strings seem like launchers and shit maybe you can oh fuck I didn't check out his moves did I Bagdash is amazing and this is the first character in this KP2 that had really has an amazing backdash. I, I was such an idiot. I didn't check out his mobility tools. Run is okay. I'd say that's pretty av average. But when you factor in this. And this. Shit kind of becomes more ridiculous. And the slide as well. So basically he has an overhead. And well no. Because he, he can't. Not as crazy as Sub-Zero's thing, honestly, slide. I don't know, maybe it just has like slower startup, it seems like. I don't know. And what did I want to check out? Oh, yeah. Wait, what? Oh, it's a parry. He has a parry x-ray. Okay, so we're going to record like... Okay. Oops. Oops. Yeah. What the hell? Wait a second, did he just throw his head? <laughs> and then it comes back. Wait, we have to see this again. Wait, no, 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 I didn't want to break. Wait, come on. What the fuck, he throws his own head. That's quite a headbutt, isn't it? That is a silly looking x-ray, I have to say. Not bad, but kind of silly. I mean, this guy looks really cool. I have no idea how to combo with him. He looks really advanced with all this drone shit. Um, I'm guessing people will be able to figure out some crazy shit, but let's move on because we have three more cyborgs to get through. Sector. Sector is next, apparently. This guy is a little bit more simple. So if you look at his moves, it's the same thing. They just all look different. So if I put up these three combos... Oh, this is a new one. These two. But even like this, same idea as with Cyber Sub-Zero, it just looks different. And that's the thing with these cyborgs, they all do that. See here, he uses the flamethrower instead of the ice. But this is the new one, right? And what, what do you cancel here? I don't get this input. Like, oh, so you can like backdash. That's actually really nice. What's the frame? And it's plus on, oh, it's only plus because you backdash. Yeah. That's actually really nice. You can like throw this out and get away safely. That's his main pressure tool probably. And this is minus one, which is nice. I mean, it's not an amazing move, but let's have a look at his special moves. I probably still need to. I'll get rid of these two, and I'll keep this up. Because I, I remember this, I remember his low. Alright. Psycho Ketchup. Is that a reference to Ketchup? Wait, we'll have to, we'll have to check out what's his name. Uh, Cyrax. And if he has a Mustard reference, well, I mean, they kind of do look like Ketchup and Mustard. Uh, the robots, because they're red. What would Smoke be then? I don't know, fucking tartar sauce or something, I don't know. Let's see, straight missile. Yeah, this is, this guy is really strong zoning, and what's his other one, I'm trying to figure out. Is it, no, that's his teleport, I do know that. Oh, it's this. We have another zoner, ladies and gentlemen. We had one already with Leatherface. She's like, look at this shit. I mean, this is Tremor on fucking speed. Yeah. And then you can just, like, uppercut him. But, I did see that when they showed off this character first in the trailer, the combo was this, right? And then something, like, maybe this? Or what else does he have? So he has these missiles, the teleport. 
Wait, what? Teleport uppercut, air cyber slam. Oh, okay. You need to EX it. Doesn't look that amazing, honestly. Like, why would you want to do this? Not a lot of damage. Alright. Oh, the flame bird. This is the one, isn't it? This is the one you want to finish with. I'll put it up. So, with this guy, you would do something like... Teleport. Hmm. Yeah. Just like a very basic combo. Wait. Teleport. Can you do that even? Yes, you can. Okay. Just need to get the timing right. So, let's try this again. Shit, I keep screwing up. Okay. Again, I'm just looking at these characters in a very basic way because basically the best way I can learn how to fight an opponent is to learn how to play the character so that's why I have a basic idea of how to play every character in this game because that's how I can figure out how to fight them or well, that's the best way I know how to figure out how to fight them but a lot of it is gonna come down to matchup knowledge I just can't hit that I don't know why I'm spending so much time with this guy, but... Hmm. Maybe you can do this instead? Let's try it. But he looks very, very cool, I have to admit. Yeah, you can probably do that. And he has this too, which is kind of insane. But, mainly, I think this is what you're gonna be doing. Just like... Look at this zoning, holy shit. He has a little lock on too. Wait, is his x-ray the same? No, it's not. Oh well, what well, kind of is. So it's the same x-ray, they just all start differently maybe? Cool. Let's move on to Cyber Sub-Zero. Again, not Cyber... What did I say? Cyrax. Again. All of these characters look pretty advanced to me. Come on, there is no... Mustard reference here. You guys just missed a huge opportunity. So, same thing. Let's see. He has these bombs, right? Oh, and that grinder thing. <laughs> Let's see that again. That's pretty fucking funny. This is Cyrex, basically. Because you can, like... I think you can do, like... Can't you, like, combo the bombs? If you time them right. Okay, whatever. So the same things. He has this. It looks like they all have a uh, one unique string. This is a low. That's nice. So what's his projectile? It's his net, right? Yes. Oops. Can you not? Yes, you can. So what's the difference between this and the EX net? So, with this guy, wait, that's his air slam. And he has the bomb and scatter. Po oh, he has the teleport as well. But this one is not an attack. He has the stupidest looking teleport ever, I think. But that's kind of his thing. Oh, and he can do the front or back. And the in the air. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Cyrex is cool. He is definitely the cyborg... I like the second most after what you call it. Cyber sub. Wait, what is this? Oh no, it's on the ground. What the fuck is this? Wow, that's kind of amazing. You can just like... So you can wait, you can do something like this. Maybe you can like knock knock him into it. Put, it, put this out first. Oops, what, what is it? Oh no, he doesn't... You have to put this out first. Or maybe not. Does it take... What? Wait a second. Can he not put... But I did put one out first, didn't I? Oh, you can't... So he can't put out... These two. But he can put out the close one and this. That's 23%. And I just like did some random shit. I can like... Knock him into it. Almost. 
But with this guy, I think what you're gonna do is like this, set up the bomb, and then go into something. Again, I don't know much about this character, but I get the basic idea. Probably can, you probably need to, need to do the EX net, right? And then do this, and then into something like, what's his air stem? Like this. Looks cool. Not gonna go too much in depth into this guy. Because, again, I know people have a lot more experience with these characters than I do. Nice. Oh, I like that. That's going to get a lot of people online. Oh, and it's a pop-up too. Hmm. Okay. I got the basic idea of his strings now. I just got to figure out some combos. Any, what's his projectile? Nice. So wait a second. Okay. And into this. Pop up. Neutral jump. Okay. Smoke. Smoke is cool. I'll look into his thing. Oh, and he has that as well. Pretty awesome. This guy looks like he has a lot of combo potential. That actually links. Wow. Very basic. I mean, I'm just like fucking around. He has an air throw, right? Yeah. Oh, wait a second. Can you direct where he's gonna be? Yes, you can. Okay. Kind of like Devora. He looks really cool. I have to admit the smoke is pretty awesome. All of these guys are pretty awesome. He has the invisibility. Can he do like reptiles thing? No, he can't. So he can't go fully invisible. But that's really strong. You can like go into classic invisible mix-up territory here. Yeah, that doesn't work. Okay, what else does he have? That's pretty nice. What about strings? Oh, he has a lot more strings. Wow. He has this. This. Wow, he has a shit ton of strings. Okay, let's just have a look. What? His teleport is now a string? Wow, that's really cool looking. Holy shit, this guy looks awesome. That is really cool. Look at how he's like... Wow, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. This guy is very cool looking. Look at that. Sh I know I'm easy to impress. So you can go like... Wait. Yes, you can. Hmm. Hmm. That is kind of ridiculous. And then go into this. Maybe you need to end with that. I don't know. Oh, you need to end with the... Okay. Wait, what is it? No. This. Into grab. Into this. Into... No. You don't need to jump after that. So just this. Into this. Very basic, but you get some basic ideas of the, what this character is about. I'm very impressed. They they nailed this character, and I kind of already predicted that uh, when I when they first showed it, him. He looks really awesome. Very advanced, I think. Sector probably looks the simplest from what I've seen. Like he was kind of the one that clicked immediately. What I'm talking about is like this and the zoning. I could get like this combo. Still haven't figured out the ender to it, but oh, you can oh, you can also do that, of course. No, that's that counts as a neutral jump. Okay. But yeah, well done, NRS. I'm really impressed with this character. He looks awesome. So can you do? No wait, it's back one, right? Yeah, that's his overhead starter. Cool. 
I like this guy. Oh wait, haven't shown off his throw. I'm impressed. I like it. Looks like a pretty fair character. Um, unless they find some crazy shit with like Cyrex. Cyrex and the Cyber Sub look the craziest with the bombs. And then Smoke and Sector look the weaker, I think. Just like first impressions. But this zoning, man. I wonder how it's gonna go against Leatherface's Pretty Lady variation. Cool. Wonder, does Shinnok still different moves from each of these guys? I don't know. I'm gonna have to find that out. I'm gonna wrap it up here. This has been a quick look at uh, Triborg in the lab. Quadborg, I should say. His jump is amazing. Look at this. Yeah, he has a good jump. Um, Quadborg or Triborg. Nailed the character. Again, like I said, uh, the videos for... This guy, these guys and Alien aren't going to be as detailed as Boraicho and Leatherface. Leatherface I just kind of had a lot of fun with. And Boraicho I want to main. But this has been just kind of like a quick look. To get, the, uh, get an idea of what this character is. Oh, this is going to be some crazy shit in the corner. And I can't neutral jump punch after that. Okay, whatever. I'm going to wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. And I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.